they got these uh, little doodads that they put under the skin. And, uh, you know, I guess makes your pussy dry out or something. <laughs> So, so so babies don't grow inside your pussy. Because yeah, so babies... that's how it works. I'm a gynecologist, everyone. No, yeah, so babies don't uh, grow and develop inside your pussy. If I was a gynecologist, uh, say you're like a girl coming in saying, saying, I think I'm pregnant. Yeah. First thing you do is, you, you know, oh, I'm a girl. I think I might be pregnant. I'm oh, feeling, really? Yeah. Well, I have to look inside your pussy now because that's where they grow. Trust me. I went to school. Now open your pussy for me, please. Thank you. Ultrasound? No, we have none of those here. No, I have to actually open up your pussy, and I have to look inside of it. What do you use? I use um, like the like a an unsharpened pencil to try to just like poke around in there. Because <laughs> I want to use a sharpened one. That's disgusting of and unsafe. And I'm not gonna use the eraser. And what if the eraser falls off? That would be bad. And what if they're like you might erase that baby? That's like an un exactly. that's an unwanted yeah. abortion. Yeah, I'm just gonna be fucking cutting them little dicks. What if uh, Dana, they wouldn't have dicks at that point. Okay. Jesus, be some, be scientific, Dana. It takes a long time for the dick to grow on the baby inside the pussy. Really? Yeah. The dick grows last. It it doesn't grow like right away. Like when some girl comes in and says, "Oh, I think I'm pregnant." I mean, if that, if, and you're if, like, "Yo, crack open that pussy." Let me yeah, check. I'm like, "Show me your pussy," so I know if you you're use pregnant like a, or not. I feel like you would use like a tongue depressor and like hold it down and maybe put well, one of those flashlight dealies that goes in your eye or I'm not, ear. Look, I'm gonna be honest. I'm not a very good doctor, and I don't have a lot of money, so I. Have a lot of like uh, popsicle sticks that sometimes I use if I run out run out of pencils. But well, you're just eating popsicles. Yeah, I mean, yeah, my saliva is on the fucking sticks, probably. Still. That's sterile, probably. I don't know. Like I said, I'm not a very good doctor, mm. but I did get a degree, and I'm definitely a gynecologist. You're definitely a gynecologist. I'm definitely a gynecologist. A hundred percent. Yeah. All right. Look, I know a lot about babies growing inside pussies. Duh. Well, when does the dick grow? Like, uh, and then they cut it off when it's born to make a girl, right? Second and they have to do one and then one, right? That's how we keep population levels. Second trimester? I mean, I mean, we're ballparking here, Chris. Uh, all right. <laughs> it's not an exact science. Okay, all right. Look, have you ever been a doctor saying this kid's going to get born in this exact day, this exact time? No. So I can't tell you oh. when exactly the fucking dick grows. I'm saying second trimester. <laughs> Ballpark. Ballpark. Yeah, that's why we trimester. break it down to trimesters yeah. in general. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's just ballpark when shit happens. Like ladder second trimester. I don't know. You want me to tell you? Month five, six? I don't know. We'll call it the second trimester. Thank you. Okay. Now I see. And and this is like, look, this this I feel like I'm back in fucking medical school, right? And I'm fucking someone's trying to mm -hmm. fucking question my shit. No, no, I'm just, you know, I'm just asking. I don't really know anything about right. it. Okay. You know, when I do when I do one of these interviews, I like to uh really I like I like to uh, interviewee to speak, you know what I mean? Oh, sure, yeah. I, I like it to be a learning experience for me, and I'm learning a lot. Good. Because that's my thing. I want to teach people mm. about, you know, childbirth. Mm -hmm. How does the actual birth happen? You just pull that some bitch out? Yeah, 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 yeah. Just like, pop it out. I get two, I get two, um, I get two, uh, old popsicle sticks. Crack that pussy open. <laughs> okay. Try well, I, now, why wouldn't you just use chopsticks? See, the, I need, I need the um, two Asian. I need the fucking the length, the fucking width of the popsicle okay. stick. Okay. Uh, and then I just I cr grab a leg mm -hmm. or the fucking head, or if it's sideways, an arm. Mm -hmm. I don't know. I jack. I Sometimes it's sideways in there. Yeah, yeah. yeah it tries right. to come out arm first, and like you can't really bring a baby in the world that creepily. No, no, so you no. You just no, shove no. that arm back in there, shift it over with the popsicle sticks. I mean, I try. I just. I try. Is it like um? Uh, Dana, can you uh, pull up a picture of photography tongs, please? I feel like maybe this would help you in your. I have I have a pair of like barbecue tongs. For, like, no, no, you don't thing. want to use that. That's like a. That's almost. A... Oh, you're gonna tell me what I should use to birth a child? <laughs> yes. Are you a fucking gynecologist? You know, you're the doctor. Yeah, thank you. I'm just trying to help. You know what I mean? Yeah, I feel you're like... not. You're not helping at all. I'm gonna be honest. Dana, with you. can you pull photography tongs? The wooden ones, please. You don't think that would be. No, Better, it's I a mean, rubber tip. It's two popsicle sticks. There's no grip. I, I need something, you know, with um, like tongs. I need something that's like has like uh, teeth on it. Mm -hmm. I mean, I really want to get a good fucking grip on that brain. Just, just on the brain, the exposed brain. I mean, sometimes they're exposed. I, I deliver a lot of premature babies. Now, are you the guy who puts on those glass I, domes on evil scientist babies? They're mostly premature babies. I deliver. Oh, really? At least I make sure they're premature because I don't like waiting. Yeah, yeah, you're super impatient. <laughs> I'm like, let's get this kid out of here. I have a long line of desperate women out front. Mm. I mean, if they're coming to me, they're in deep shit or deep baby. 
Uh, I just, uh, I assume you perform these procedures on some sort of black leather couch. Come on, man. I got one of those fucking sex wedges I put them on. Okay. That fuck, I, I just, I put them on. But like, still has the stirrups from a regular gynecological chair or a higher end gynecologist. Sorry, no. I, don't mean, I don't mean to say regular. The way you do is how medicine works. No stirrups. I just get that sex wedge, put them on with head down like you know on the fucking low end. Oh, so they're pussy. Face down, fuck. ass up. Well, on the back, though. So, like, mi- like, elevated missionary. Okay. And then I just fucking drag that baby out. I don't like to use gravity. Well, I, I mean, feel like gravity pushing been... that baby, like, closer into the stomach, that makes the baby stronger. If these kids come into the world with a little bit of a struggle, maybe they'll be stronger children. Exactly. Right? Now, when do you cut the dick off? Yeah, 